हेलो एवरी वन माई सेल्फ वैष्णवी बोबड़े एंड टूडे इज माई प्रेजेंटेशन टॉपिक इज फुट प्रिंट लेफ्टिंग अवर फर्स्ट टॉपिक इज इंट्रोडक्शन टू फुट प्रिंट लेफ्टिंग फर्स्ट पॉइंट इज डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द सर्फेस एंड लोकेशन ऑफ द प्रिंट वॉज लैप फॉरेंसिक इन्वेस्टिगेटर मे हैव अ नैरो विंडो इन विच टू लिफ्ट द प्रिंट अवर सेकेंड पॉइंट इज दे कैन लिफ्ट इंप्रेशन फ्रॉम एनी ऑफ द सर्फेस मे बी पोरस और नॉन पोरस और थर्ड पॉइंट इज प्रिंट्स लेफ्ट इन ब्लड मे लास्ट फॉर ईयर्स बट प्रिंट्स लेफ्ट इन वॉटर मे इवेपोरेट एंड प्रिंट्स लेफ्ट इन सैंड मे बी ब्रश्ड अवर फर्स्ट पॉइंट फोर्थ पॉइंट इज लिफ्टिंग इंप्रूव द विजिबिलिटी एंड डिटेल्स ऑफ द इम्प्रेशन ट्रांसफर इट टू द सर्फेस दैट प्रोवाइड बेटर कॉन्ट्रास्ट एंड अवर फिफ्थ पॉइंट है इलेक्ट्रोस्टैटिक डस्ट लिफ्टर डिवाइस विच हैज चार्ज a plastic film which is placed over the dust print it causes dust to adhere to film our sixth point is the print may be composed of loose dry residue for this method our seventh point is latent print may be dusted with fingerprint powder and lifted with gelatin lifters and our eighth point is this lifters have thick layer of gelatin or an vinyl or cloth ba- backing that is covered with a protective clay now our second topic is equipment and requirements first equipment is appropriate light source second is electrostatic dust lifter and film third is adhesive and gelatin lifting material fourth is fingerprint powder fifth is dental stone and sixth is micro seal or poly vinyl silicoxane pvs casting material and seventh is sufficient time and facilities to complete the procedure then our next next topic is procedures procedures first pro- first procedure is when lifting a footprint examiner should be least destructive method if in doubt treat all the impressions as a dry origin and apply the method listed below if unsuccessful attempt con- uh, collections as indicated for wet origin impression all procedures shall be performed when applicable and noted when appropriate the order and use of these individual techniques is determined by consideration such as substrate components of impression and environmental conditions then our second procedure is electrostatic dust lifter electrostatic dust lifter is useful for the detection and lifting of dry origin dust and residue impression which are the result of tracking from dry dirty surface on to relatively cleaner surface second point is electrostatic lifting is normally the first technique used as unsuccessful attempt will not prevent subsequent lifting and enhancement technique the third point is there are a number of electrostatic lifter available consult the manual man consult the manual provided by the manufacturer for specific operating instruction our fourth point is all these devices utilize a film which has a black side and an aluminum aluminum coated side the black side of the film is placed against the impression and the and a high voltage charge is applied to the film resulting in the transfers of Uh, the dry dirty uh, dry dust or residue impressions our fifth fifth point is to visualize the lift impression the lift should be examined in a dark room with a high intensity light source held at an oblique angle to the surface of the lift our sixth point is the lifting film should never be reused the seventh point is a uh, smaller lift can be stored in individual clear file folder these folders should not be reused eight point is larger lifter can be stored by carefully rolling with the aluminum side outed after rolling the edges can be secured with a small piece of tape nine point is electrostatic lifter are fragile and impressions can be destroyed by an whipping action across the surface of the lift consideration should should be given to be photographed lift prior should lift prior to packing electrostatic lifting retain a charge and should not be packed in cardboard card box our third procedure is adhesive and gelatin lifting material first footprint footwear size adhesive and gelatin lifters are used for the lifting of dust and residue impression wet imp- origin impression as well as impression developed with fingerprint powder second is gelatin lifter are available in white black and clear color 
White lifter provide greater contrast with impression enhanced with dark color powder. Black lifters provide great contrast with light color powder and residue impressions. Clear lifter normally do not provide good contrast. Gelatin lifter uh, gelatin lifts of residue impression should be photographed as soon as possible for collections. Then our third is adhesive lifters are available in white and clear. They include footprint size, sheet and various width of roll tab. White background are recommended for clear adhesive clear adhesive clear adhesive on the clear background is not recommended these lifts are normally used for impression developed with dark colored powders and are not recommended for lifts dusted or residue impression roll tapped are available in 5 inch width and are preferred to as narrow tap Now our fourth procedure is dental stone. Dental stone can be used to lift impressions such as mud and tire residues from surfaces such as concrete and tile. A thick layer of dental stone can be poured over the impression area and lifted when dry. Our fifth procedure is polyvinyl silicoexane PVS or microcell. Microcell or other polyvinyl silicoexane caustic material can be used to lift impression enhanced with powder from any surface. This products lift the complete powder impression in impressions and are particularly used on textured surface. Now here is our procedure completed. Thank you everyone.